Alright, hey there, what is up guys? Welcome back to the newest video on Purple Haze. And uh, we'll be doing some adrift. I've already recorded the first couple of episodes without any commentary in it. I just thought the experience needed to be captured. And also uh, my microphone wasn't working, so there was that. But uh, this game is really really good to be honest it it's so good that it kind of it, it really does scare me a little bit <laughs> just like especially this part like I really uh, I didn't finish this game I just got like about a quarter way I would say um, <clears throat> and it just freaked me out like uh, Wait a second. Am I going the right way? Oh yeah. It really freaked me out the uh, the level of um, realism it invokes because geez, like it this honestly feels really, really like trippy. It's personal log. System specialist McDonough Andrew, seventeen April, twenty thirty seven. Finally going home. Doesn't even seem real. 22 months since mission start. 10 longer than I signed up for in the first place. I promised Lucy I was going to be there for her. I promised myself I wouldn't leave her like this again. Broke both of those promises by taking another selfish paycheck job while real life passes me by down below. Father of the year. Alex really came through for me on this. I owe her one. Can't wait to get off this goddamn station. Yeah, so uh, I'm sorry if you can hear my PlayStation just uh, screaming at me in the background. But um, yeah, this part really freaked me out the first time I played it because I was like, okay, like, you know, it's, it's just so quiet, man. Like, this game is so quiet. There's like nothing going on and the only sound is just the emptiness and like occasionally like you'll just hear something bump into something like something that's floating around or some shit like that. Damn it just it really freaks me out man. Like the first time I, I played this section I was like okay for sure I'm gonna like there's gonna be some kind of a, a jump scare like I'm gonna uh, find some kind of a body or something like that uh, or maybe somebody's still gonna be like alive but you know that wasn't what happened I'm just gonna stay here for about two seconds if you want to read this you can pause and read it I'm not gonna read it or should I read it oh yeah let's, let's just read it okay so Alex Lynn contacted me already Everything is in motion. Can't thank you enough for this. Got a lot of missed time to make up for down there. Collins is solid. He's smart. Eager and doesn't have the baggage I do. He's slated for hand V. Oh, hand 5. So calling, so calling him up early will be a big break for him. Good choice. Oh, stuttering. Maybe I can... Why is it stuttering? Maybe I can help with early beta? Let me know. Andrew. Lynn Collette from Hardyman Resource will be contacting you to work everything out. She also places for Vancouver, so that will be very good for you down the road. I'll need you right up to Spiritus Beta and crew expansion, so that looks like 8th of July transfer. Maybe even before then. I'm working out how to get to beta earlier, so it's a possibility. Like, the way that you uh, hold on to the computer and stuff like that, I thought that as soon as I let go, there's gonna be like someone pop up behind me. What the hell are you looking at my PC for? <laughs> some shit like that. <laughs> it just it really freaked me out. Yeah. Anyway. So, uh. Um, 
How do I unlock this door? Or is it locked for a reason? I think I have to do something to unlock that door. Oh my god, yeah, this is where you have to go out of the space station again and kind of float around out here. I hate this part. Woo! What, what is it telling me to look at? What is that? Oh. Is there still glass up here? What is going on? Can I not go up? Is there still glass up there? It looks broken. What? Am I just smashing myself into glass? Oh no, no, no. There we go. So this is uh, this is where it starts to freak me the hell out. <laughs> I mean, jeez, man, imagine just, imagine being out here, like, this is, woo, this is some scary shit, I ain't gonna lie, this is some scary, scary ass shit, man, okay, where am I supposed to be going, oh, it's telling me to go there, oh, shit, dude, I have very little oxygen, gotta get the oxygen from right over here, Okay, so uh, I'm just going to hit pause real quick.